So hello guys, welcome to DTW Tutorials, welcome. Okay, you know I promised to do a video where I will be praying for you finally for your exam. Okay, and this is that video. Alright, and I said I'll be giving you some tips on, you know, especially what to do a night before your exam. It is important. Alright, a night to your exam is important what you do. Okay, so it doesn't affect your the next day, the day of your exam. Okay, so after I discuss that with you, then I will pray for you finally. And you are destined to win. Okay, you are destined to win in the forthcoming jam 2024 examination. So please, I beg of you, please do share this video with your friends, family, you know, your loved ones in your groups, preparing for the forthcoming jam 2024 examination. Okay, so it's exactly seven days to your exam. So I like doing this earlier so it gets to a lot of people. And, you know, they try to prep their mind on what to do a night before the exams okay so the first thing you're to do all right a night before your exam just try to revise now revision not i'm not saying that you go and open you start opening all your desks no the things you have jotted down even if you read one month to exam two months to exam one week to exam there are some things you should have jotted down okay on your booklets especially your formulas Go through those, you know, the, the 135 physics formulas. Please join the Telegram group. You'll get that. It's free. You know, every, you, uh, students keep on asking me when I get to the Telegram group, I don't see it. When you get to Telegram, there's, you know, why I love Telegram is that you can save documents, all right? So there has, there has been a lot of PDF documents that have been saved several years. You know, I started that Telegram group, I think, 2020 or 2021. I can't, I can't remember. So... There are several documents, PDF, books, things on it. So you can go to a session. When you are on Telegram, there's a section called files. Go to files and you scroll down and you see several of those PDF documents and you just download and use the one that, you know, would help you. So get all your formulas. If you're in phys your physics, um, if you're doing uh, chemistry, if you're doing mathematics, you know, all those important formulas, get them down. If you're doing other subjects, arts, uh, government, all those important dates that you know, uh, you know, it's been said more, you know, go through all those. Okay, so that's the revision I'm talking about here, not to open your textbook now. Okay, so you revise, revise. You can also do some practice, all right, on the on the app. That's the DTW Tutorials Jam CBT app. You can do some practice and, you know, that's that's what you do. Not Nothing too stressful that night you know if you've been preparing for a, a while nothing too stressful but if you are still reading <laughs> i got the message you know i don't let me not even go there if you are still reading let's say you just start reading now seven days to your exam it means that night you'll still be reading and what you should be doing it is you are practicing a cbt app that's what you should be doing okay so revise revision now the second thing you should do is you have to plan your journey logistics you, you take you can look at this thing down like what is what am i talking about logistics plan what do you need don't worry i'm going to do a video on on the things that jam will allow you please don't do this lally you know this lally um uh i think this painting please don't do it don't cover your thumbprint because you won't be able to be verified to enter into your, the hall you know anyway i'm going to do that video also the things to expect on your exam day what and what you should expect okay so but let me just say it you're going to do a thumbprint before you are allowed into the hall so please don't do it lally please okay now logistics what do you take in your exam print slip make sure you print like three why do i say print like three you would you might give out one when you are entering the hall then maybe two because they might not share you share a sheet of uh, paper to you for calculation for those doing calculation so print out enough copies all right so you have one i've seen students come to me that ma i didn't get any sheet i couldn't do any calculation you know that alone can limit you so print out enough of your exam slip print the colored one okay print out like three copies have that have your pencil all right and most importantly have your change Right now, most people, you I'm sure you must have seen your jam center before the exam day. This is part of the logistics. Before the exam day, make sure you find your center. Know the amount it takes to, for you to get there. Know the buses it takes for you to get there. You know, there are like four batches in a the day. There's 7 a.m. I think there's 10, 9, 
there's a 12, there's 3 p.m. So if you're a 7 a.m. person, you should know that you should leave home very early. So you need to know the amount and you need to prepare change. It's not that that money you carry 1,000, earning the money you carry 1,000 and give Keke man or Akada man, they will delay you. That's already, your time is already going. And you know, when you are delayed, when you are late, you will even get more tense getting to the hall. So um, you have to prep well so you are not tensed up when you get to the hall the next day. So these are the things to do a night for your exam. Prepare all your 50 50 naira, your 100 naira change so that nobody disturbs you in the bus. You pay and come down and go to your center. Okay? So another thing you do with three again is what you relax, you sleep. Please, even if you are reading, uh, you, you are, you know, you are doing this uh, Zoom reading, you just started reading, you have to still sleep. If not, you could crash your brain. Everything that you've been reading will just, will just go away. Okay? So at least sleep well. From 11, sleep. Have a good sleep. And before you sleep, please do not go and start eating things that will make you purge, like beans or something or whatever. No, don't do that to yourself. Please, I beg you. And even so, that is sleep and relaxation. I think that's my, my third point. All right, so make sure you sleep well. Let your mom help tell your mom or an elderly person to wake you up. All right. Okay. At, you know, set your alarm. You know, it depends on your own time of your exam. All right. And please, before you get into the hall, please eat something. Now, don't eat something that would disturb your tummy. Eat a, a bar of chocolate. You need something for brain power because, you know, you're putting a lot of stress on your brain under two hours to solve over how many questions. Are you getting me? So you need, you need brain power. You need brain food. Chocolates can help you or you eat good food. Please don't go into that hall like without food though, because your eye can start turning you or you start feeling dizzy. Please make sure you eat something in the morning before you start your exam. Very important. Okay. Now, please. Also, when you get to your exam centers, avoid malpractice and um, runs. Okay. It will distract you. Once you start, don't go into a group that, that start, they start talking about math. No, it will distract. It will even make every, so most of the things you read for you will forget it. Even right now, let's say you're going to physical centers, you know, your, you know, your tutorial centers. Avoid all those groups that are always talking about math practice. Just study and put your help, your faith in God. Depend on him. Study. Okay? So, that's what, so please. Avoid anything that will make you tense up in on that day. Avoid all those groups. Okay? And that takes me finally to the last point where I'll be praying for you. All right? There's nothing that God cannot do. It's a God that answers prayers. I tell you. Pray. Open your mouth and pray, Lord. Any fear that is coming to you, pray and cast it out. Cast it out. The Lord has not given you the spirit of fear. But he has given you the spirit of power and a sound mind and a spirit of what love. That's what the Lord has given to you. Are you with me? So right now I pray and I cancel anyone that's been gripped by fear. That is in, uh, you know, you're under the bondage of fear. I break that yoke in the name of Jesus. By the blood of Jesus, that yoke of fear is broken over your life in the name of Jesus. Fear has no place in your life again in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. You know what the word of God said? He said that he would help you, that you should not fear, that the Lord will help you. He said, don't be dismayed. Don't be discouraged. He will help you. He will bring, see, everything you've read, he will bring it to remembrance. He will, the Holy Ghost will bring it to remembrance. And that's what the Lord will do in your situation in jesus name so i pray now again for favor favor upon you even upon your jam center it shall be favor all through the computer system you are going to use i soak it in the blood of jesus there shall be no technical issues in the name of jesus christ even that your center Anyone that wants to come there and do my practice that will not affect the hope center result, I block that person from coming into that center in the name of Jesus. I cancel that evil. It will not be a story of, oh, man, somebody came dead. It, it's, it's not your story in the name of Jesus. See, you are destined to win. 
you will go sit for that exam and you will come out in flying colors in the name of Jesus. I pray for you for the spirit of excellence upon you in the name of Jesus. Yes, the spirit of excellence. Receive it in Jesus' name. See, this, you know, the test is all about speed and accuracy. I pray speed like never before upon you. Accuracy in solving your questions, in reading once and understanding. Hey, that is speed though. You read once, you understand. And you are going to be accurate in picking your options in the name of Jesus. There shall be no error. I cancel everyone that the spirit of error is following. Hey, the Lord rebukes you, you spirit of error. I bind that spirit hands and feet and I cast into bottomless pity. Christ comes in the name of Jesus. Anyone that suddenly when you are at the edge of you and an, an advancement, suddenly there's sickness, sickness just come into you. Oh, I break that yoke by the power and the blood of Jesus Christ. I plead the blood of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus. I plead the blood of Jesus Christ. If that power shall never overtake you, overcome you in the name of Jesus Christ. Hey, it is not your portion. Hey, I say in the name of Jesus, it is not your portion. Ah, that power, the Lord rebukes you. You shall go into this examination in strength, in might, and come out with testimony in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, I pray for this one's Lord. Retentive memory like never before. Magnetic brain. All they have read. Oh Father, favor. Bless the works of their hands. Let there be increase. Lord, 300 plus upon everyone listening, connecting to DTW tutorials. Lord, 300 plus. Father, Lord. Oh, reward, reward their labors, oh Father, with success, with 300 plus in their examination, in Jesus' name. Let them come with testimonies, for in Jesus' name, I pray, amen. I soak my prayers in the blood of Jesus. I soak all these prayers in the blood of Jesus. Physical manifestation to my prayers, answers to these prayers. I soak in the blood of Jesus. Receive your testimony. You are destined to win. In the forthcoming jam, two into his four examination, you are destined to win in Jesus' name. Amen. You are destined to win. You are blessed. All right. You are highly favored of God. All right. Don't, no fear. Enter. If there's if fear is still disturbing you, listen to this video over and over again and speak to yourself, I am destined to win. Listen to it over and over again and speak to yourself, I am destined to win. Oh Lord, I pray for favors. Everyone having financial struggles that don't have finance, oh Lord, even to go to their jam center, Lord, miraculously supply in the name of Jesus Christ. Amen. You dead. I said, the Lord will supply you with financial blessings in the name of Jesus. Yes. For in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Father, thank you, Lord, for answer prayers. And I pray also for someone that, I don't know, you see, everyone around you has looked down on you. They have looked down on you. Like, pata, pata, who is this one? Nothing will happen. Ah, God. The Lord shall lift you up and make you a star in that family in the name of Jesus. And it starts from this. Hey, you will gain admission into university and you will come out as a success and as, you see, a pioneer in that your family. Hey, and everyone will look at you and be giving your testimony. Even you, you will be amazed at what the Lord will do for you. For in Jesus' name I pray. Amen. Thank you, Lord, for answer prayers. Thank you, Father, for answer prayers. Oh, Lord, be with these ones. Oh, Lord, take care of them. I envelope them in your love, in your, in your glory, in your power. In Jesus' name, I pray. Amen. You are destined to win. Don't forget, please. Please do give your life to Jesus Christ. He's the way, he's the truth, and he's the life. It is only in Jesus, though. He's the way. He's the one that has the, the true power. All right? So thank you. And um, I think, am I forgetting anything? Yeah, please. You can get the DTW CBT app to practice. And there are other links. Just check the video description box. You'll see other things that would help you from DTW tutorials. All right, thank you. And see you in our next video. Don't forget to please share this video with your friends, family, and loved ones. Take care and stay blessed.